Solid copper lanterns for 15 bucks? Go try to beat that. They say an eco-friendly house can't be built in 150 days for $150,000, and I say it can. I'm Alan Smith. Join me as I push the limits with time, budget, and creativity with the Garden Home Challenge, exclusively on eHow Home. I found these great carriage lights in an antique store, and they were $15 each. And um, this one is in good shape. And um, I pointed these out before. This one has beveled glass on it. And um, hey, it even came with a light bulb for $15. How can you beat that? Not sure it really works. But you can see how important having a door on it is to make this thing work properly. These are fairly simple. And uh, today they've become very popular as a way to accentuate the exterior or even the interior of a home. And these are made of copper, so I'm really excited that we were able to figure out a way to, to, to modify these because this one, you may remember, the glass was shattered. And so the exercise was to figure out how we could keep the hinged door on it where it's operational and have glass placed on either side because the back side is metal and it's a different type of metal that's meant to sort of reflect even more light out, which is the purpose of these things. So what uh, Tony did is he actually measured the glass and on the sides, what we did is we took the broken pieces of beveled glass out and eventually what we'll do is we'll take this beveled glass out uh, because we can't match it. And so on the sides, what we have here is a piece that is of uh, five inches and seven eighths in size square. It's an eighth of an inch piece of glass here on the side and the same over here on this side you can see here. The only difference is that it's not beveled. So here's where we were having the problem with the hinge door. You can see the hinge remained, but the exterior framing for the hinge was gone. So, I mean, after all, it's 15 bucks, what do you expect? So the idea here is to simply take this piece of glass, again, uh, five inches square, five, seven eighths inches square, take it, and I'm just gonna take some epoxy, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna mix this epoxy, 50-50 epoxy with hardener. Got a little stick here, and I'm gonna mix this all together. Mix that up, there we go. And then I'm gonna take this and just get a little bit on the end of this spatula-like tool. And then what I wanna do is I just wanna take it and I wanna slide it right down in this wedge here, right along in there, because that's where that piece of glass needs to be held. This stuff is really strong. So once this piece of glass goes in here, let's get a little more. So here's the piece of glass. So I'm gonna slide it back into this slot here now with the epoxy. And I'm going to make sure that it closes. From this hinge front door, we'll be able to easily remove the light bulbs and replace them. So there you go. I just love it. Ultimate recycling with great style. If you're enjoying these updates on the house, check in regularly. We got a million of them. And make sure you subscribe to eHow Home.